So just wanted to make a quick NFL news and rumors video for you guys talking about B. John Robinson out of Texas University uh, and some teams that are interested in drafting him in this upcoming 2023 NFL draft. So uh, here on the screen is a tweet from NFL notifications on Twitter, which says there are reportedly multiple teams that view Texas running back B. John Robinson as the best overall player in this year's draft per Jeremy Fowler ESPN. Uh, even with this uh, even with this being the case, B. John is unlikely to go in the top 10 uh, with it not being a good value to spend a top 10 pick on a running back. Uh, the Buccaneers, the Bills, the Cowboys, and the Eagles are among the teams most likely to be landing spots. So yeah, there's going to be a lot of hype surrounding B. John Robinson heading into the 2023 NFL draft, um, as mentioned in this tweet by Jeremy Fowler. Um, team, teams are actually viewing B. John Robinson as probably the best talent in this draft and the best value in this draft, uh, but teams are going to be a little bit hesitant on spending a top draft pick on him because historically speaking running backs in the top 10 the top 5 the top 15 aren't really the best of value and it's not really a good draft um, in regards to you know other skilled players out there there's a lot of other players that could definitely be uh, I guess more intriguing in the top 10 so um, I guess Bijan Robinson for that standpoint is probably going to slide but if teams are really high on this guy then why not draft him with a top 10 pick right what's the end of the world it's not the end of the world get a player that you feel like is going to help this team whatever team drafts him and if you think Bijan Robinson is the best player in the draft why would you not pull a top 10 draft pick on him? I know historically speaking, it's not the best value you need. You don't want to spend a ton um, of money on running backs down the road. I totally understand. Uh, but teams like the Buccaneers, the Bills, the Eagles, and the Cowboys could definitely all use running backs. Now, uh, the Buccaneers moved on from Leonard Fournette um, from, you know, this past off season. Um, so I think that, you know, with Rashad White probably taking, you know, three downs, you know, running back one snaps for them fully in 2023. I guess it's not a terrible option to have B. John Robinson go in there, but they don't really need him, I would say. I think that if they're all in on Rashad White, not a bad idea for them to go down that direction. Now, uh, the Buffalo Bills would actually be a team that I would look at tremendously for B. John Robinson. Um, I think he would be an awesome fit there. Makes a lot of sense. Checks a lot of boxes. Um, adding Bijan to this offense with Josh Allen, um, Stefan Diggs, Gabe Davis, Dawson Knox. Um, I think it'd just be a good move for them. So I'm definitely a big fan of the Bills. Uh, maybe even drafting, you know, moving up in, in, in the draft to trade up a little bit and get Bijan Robinson. I think that'd be a great spot for him landing wise. Um, the Philadelphia Eagles, same sort of deal with the Buffalo Bills. Um, they lost, of course, Miles Sanders, who was their go to guy. Now it's a little bit more running back by committee in, uh, in Philadelphia for next year. They also did sign Rashad Penny as well, um, who historically speaking is a tremendous running back when healthy, but he gets injured a lot. So that could be a question mark there. I don't mind the Eagles drafting him whatsoever. Uh, they might look to draft a defensive player, though. I think that might be the direction the Eagles go. And the Dallas Cowboys, right? They moved off of Ezekiel Elliott as well. Uh, Tony Pollard's going to be running back one in Dallas for 2023. Never a bad option, though, to replace, um, you know, B. John Robbins, or sorry, Ezekiel Elliott with the younger B. John Robinson uh, and sort of go through the process that way. So I actually could see a world where all four of these teams are in the market for drafting B. John Robinson. I think, though, the Bills, the Eagles, and the Cowboys probably make the most sense on um, the Buccaneers because they just, you know, they have Rashad White from a couple of years ago who they drafted. So not a super big priority there, but uh, for teams like the Bills, the Eagles, and the Cowboys, I would keep an eye on for them to draft Bijan Robinson if he is there available at their pick. And you never really know, right? Maybe teams trade up to draft this guy. He's that talented. So uh, leave your thoughts down below in the comment section of this video. Thanks again for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.